Hey guys, what's up? It is Dynamunch here, and I'm here with Trine, an indie game that is, I don't know what it is, but it's on sale on the Humble Bundle, which I will link in the description below. You can go and buy this with a couple of other games, it's like a bundle, and you can pay whatever you want for the bundle. Uh, I had just like some money uh, left, over, left over on my PayPal, so I decided to just, you know, um, go ahead and buy it and try it out and make a let's play for you guys today my legs really itchy god damn it okay one take one take so uh i had to turn off the music because youtube's new id thing and you know music and all that so i had to turn that off sorry but you still have the sound effects um i've got the graphical settings on very high and uh, what is um what do you say so yeah i've got the music off i still have ambient effects and speech on so let's go and by the way, I don't know, uh, hang on, what's this? So, let's see. The hell do I choose? I guess I'll choose that. Um, let's go easy, because I'm a noob. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, a kingdom was prospering. But peace could only last so long. The old king died. With no descendant to the throne, the kingdom fell into chaos. Lust for power blinded warriors and wizards alike. New kings emerged only to fall the next day. But the madness of men would soon be overshadowed by a far greater evil. The magic that once gave life and good fortune had transformed into something sinister. One by one, grave by grave, the dead began to rise, feeding off the energy that grew stronger with each passing night. Fear spread throughout the kingdom, and it was soon abandoned. But something was about to happen that would change the course of history. On the outskirts of the kingdom, near the Astral Academy, a thief carried out her cunning plan. She had learned of an ancient object of tremendous value. The Astral Academy, left to rot in the face of the terrible enemy, had no one to keep the treasure safe. The time was right. Everything was perfect. She had made her way to the castle and would soon lay her hands on the treasure she so desired. So this is a really cool looking game. Very sweet. So, oh wow, that's really cool. Right clicks this grapple thing, which you can climb up and down, which is cool. And right click to let go. To move and jump is WASD, so let's jump on this. The visual effects on this game look really cool. Should I jump there or down here? Let's try here first. See what we've got. Ah, nothing, just... Oh, cool! That's really nice. Okay. Let's go across the chains. Use a grappling hook. So we're going through here. Oh, go. Get closed. Ooh. Ooh, okay. What am I doing? Just. Do I do this? Okay, here. Yeah. Oh, oh, that looks pretty suspicious. Haha, <laughs> I knew it. The gentle moon smiled at the thief as she made her way towards the shrine of ancient treasure. Strangely, the protective charms around the shrine allowed her to enter unharmed. Wow. 
So I guess I'm a thief and I'm trying to steal this treasure again. I got it. As the thief lay her hand on the treasure, she had a tingling sensation. The thief would soon discover that fate had taken hold of her. Unknown to the thief, a wizard was just waking up. The wizard had taken a look in the spyglass and seen the terrible undead army. He was keen not to die. By my trousers, I must escape. He had been studying the stars and trying hard to learn the elusive fireball spell that all wizards ought to know. Of course, that was a lie. For you see, the wizard had a certain reputation with the ladies. What he had really been up to was the creation of a fake fireball potion that would have impressed the ladies and improved his status. The potion had backfired, causing a fortnight of sleep. Oh. That's so cool. So now we're the wizard, we can levitate items. Which is right click. No, I can't make it there. Stop spinning. No, I can't, so... I'm gonna have to use these blocks. Oh, okay. <laughs> that didn't kill me. <laughs> there we go. Let's make cute little steps as well. So why not? Oh, there's something here. What's... Oh, wait, what? Oh, what was up there? Alright, never mind. Draw a square. That is so cool! Wizard saw a glimmering light coming from the shrine. No one had been able to visit it for centuries because of the ancient magic protecting whatever lay inside. Oh, that is so cool. My darling, why the painful look on such a pretty face? What is this object you are holding on to? How did you get here? The wizard touched the thief's hand and then the object. His hand got stuck. What kind of trickery is this? For once, the wizard was more interested in magic than anything else. He was also afraid for his dear life. But there was someone nearby who welcomed a challenge. At the other end of the Astral Academy, a knight had been practicing his own skills to battle the undead and prove himself worthy of joining the king's army. Between me and you, he did not quite understand what undead meant. But this was his chance to be the bravest knight of all. The knight felt it was his duty to protect the Astral Academy during this time of despair. He was on the lookout for anything unusual. That is so cool. You can play as different characters. Wow. Oops. Oh, okay. What's here? See a health potion. What? What are these? I don't know. Let's get this one as well. So I guess these are hidden around the world, and you have to get them. Okay. All right. So you can't do that. Oh god. Oh, what's this? Oh, 
Yeah, move. Oh, 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 oh. What's going on? <laughs> I love the guy's voice like, oh, what's going on? The knight saw a faint light coming from the age-old shrine. Could there be a thief? Was this the knight's day of honor? He had sworn an oath to himself to Wait. protect the shrine and the academy. Nothing could stand in his way. So, they they all take the same bridge, except the entry is always, like, different. Like, what? That makes no sense. What's going on? The knight joined in, taking a firm grip of the object's third side, in a way that only a mighty warrior can. Oh, no. This doesn't bode well. What doesn't bode well? There was a flash of light, and the wizard, the thief, and the knight simply disappeared. Our new heroes were overwhelmed by the effect of the mysterious object. The wizard tried hard to remember everything he'd learned of the shrine and its artifact. His mind raced through ancient tales. Tales and legends. It's all her fault. We must take her into custody. She stole the king's treasure. Did you not understand a word I said? It is not treasure. It's an ancient object. The trine. I believe it has bound our souls. We are stuck together. But she... The thief remains silent. She was waiting for the right moment to escape, hopefully with the treasure and without the pair of fools. Hmm. I think I know how we can use the device as we like. Oh, you can change characters. I kind of knew that you would be able to, but... Okay, I guess you can't do that, but that's so sick. Uh, apparently I can't get up there anymore, so I have to do this. So I'm gonna just go up there and see what's up there. I did miss that green thing, so... Hopefully that doesn't affect us too much. What? Yay. <laughs> they don't scare me! Oh God! Oh, you can change characters, like, on the spot. You don't get teleported or anything. Oh, what have I got myself into? We have to find a way to reverse the spell, to undo the magic. The Tomb of the Guardian in the Catacombs may have the answer, and it's not far away. Is that how you do it? No. Oh, wait, maybe we can, um... Oh god. Okay, so that's experience. Alright. I'm gonna have to use that guy. What am I supposed to do to get that? Pretty hurt. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, yes. Now let's go get the other one. <laughs> Maybe I can make like a lot of them. Oh, that's massive. Oh, wait. I could just do that. Dirt. Alright, so let's go back. Seriously, come on. What's that? Uh. 
Hey guys, sorry that the video ended just suddenly right here. Um, I was actually recording um, more than this, but I ran out of hard drive space, so it just stopped recording and I didn't even realize. So you will miss uh, a good about 30 minutes of gameplay, but it doesn't matter because nothing really happens between that time. And I do uh, get you guys up to date in the next episode, so yeah. But I do want to say thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoy this little Let's Play series and I'll see you guys in the next chapter.